Hello and welcome to this short video about pool party batch linking. I will show you how to generate links automatically or semi-automatically between two different taxonomies. Before I start with the actual demo, I just give you an example why this might be important to you. If you think about a, a company or an organization um, which is, let's say, more or less distributed over several sites and subsidiaries are maybe in this conglomerate of organizations, then every department or sub-organization will deal with specific concepts and specific content. Therefore, it might be a good idea to split apart the taxonomies into different modules. So let's um, assume that every um, sub-organization has its own taxonomy, then it's possible to make links between the um, sub-taxonomies on the one hand side and also to establish more or less a hub in the middle as a, as a central reference point and therefore again it's good to have mappings between the more specific taxonomies and the general one. So I'd say that's a typical architecture of an organization when creating and maintaining taxonomies on a professional level. So so far, linking of taxonomies um, was kind of a tedious process and with Pool Party 4.5 you now have got the possibility to get support from the machine which helps you detect links between taxonomies. Okay, let's start with a short example. I've loaded Scott which is a controlled vocabulary provided by Education Services Australia. It's also available as linked open data and I'd like to show you how to generate uh, mappings to Eurowalk. Therefore um, I go to project linking and you can see I've already picked two of the available taxonomies on that server as uh, taxonomies you can make links to potentially. Um, in this view, that's the tree view, you can do that manually by drag and drop. But I will show you the batch linking. So here um, you have a dialog in place. Uh, in the first uh, step you just pick the project you want to make links to. So I leave it with Eurowalk and down here you can uh, drag and drop a subtree of your source taxonomy, in that case Scott, if you want. If you don't do that and just li click on link uh, instantly then both taxonomies will be analyzed completely. So uh, every single concept is a potential a candidate to make mappings to the other concepts of the target taxonomy. But I will pick a, a concept scheme here. Uh, maybe I go for health. So I uh, drag and drop health here and start the linking process now. In general I would say it will now take about uh, one maximum two minutes to generate the mappings. Um, that's um, an average time you can uh, estimate or expect when you work with taxonomies like Scott or Eurowalk which have around seven to 8,000 concepts, uh, around 15,000 labels and so on. Um, yeah, you see it might take less in that case because I uh, I've chosen a, a sub-component of my Scott Desaurus, in that case um, health. And here we go. That's the, um, the result. I can now approve or I can reject. And if I'm not sure, I can take a look on the tree and look up the context. So psychoanalysis, I'd say, is a perfect match. And you can see here also you can uh, use other 
scores mapping properties than exact match. There are others provided by the standard. In that case, I go for an exact match and now it's approved. Okay, so you work through this list and of course you save a lot of time when you get a list provided by the machine and um, that's about it. If you have the mappings done, you can publish them on the link data server which is also provided by pool party or you just make use of the mappings programmatically which means for instance if you are um, offering a search refinement widget to your uh, end users you can now could also make use of the mappings and show things like okay people who are interested in this might be also interested in that so for instance if the target taxonomy has been used to annotate and classify other repositories you could now if an API is available for that purpose you could now display um, content from other sources so I think mappings between taxonomies are a really powerful extension of what's been offered pa uh, by a, a, a traditional taxonomy tool and uh, if you want to try it out please feel free to get a demo account uh, on our uh, server or of course if you want to dive deeper into that feature and, and learn more about that we are very happy to talk to you and give you a live demo. Okay, many thanks for your attention and I hope you enjoyed that. Bye-bye.